we want to face life like ever with gladness and never with regret as years go by. How marvelous it is, O oh Lord, that you have contemplated each of us before we were made. How marvelous that you considered and created us, decreeing the very time and place that each of us should enter the world to live out our own part of your grand story. And we celebrate today the first appearance of Peter in the epic tale of redemption. We gather to celebrate and to give thanks that their life and days are woven with ours, that we might share the joys and burdens of life together, delighting in the ways your glory is reflected in the unrepeatable gift of their blessing, their being. <laughs> you have created each of us, O oh Lord, to bear your image in unique expression, reflecting a facet of your glory in a way that no other person in all of history will, so that by knowing one another, we might also know you better. And so we celebrate and honor your image, O oh God, uniquely reflected in the life and in the personhood of Peter. Bless this, your child, in the year to come, May they know the comfort of your presence, of the certainty of your purpose, and the consolation of your love at work in their life. Grant them wisdom, maturity, vision, and passion in increasing measure that they might be an instrument well honed for the building of your kingdom. Bless them with loving family and enduring friendships that they might make their journey ever surrounded by the steadying companionship of fellow pilgrims. May they invest their moments well in the coming year and in all years to follow, living life always with the end in view, in pursuit of that eternal prize that will allow them to look ever with gladness and never with regret upon the passing of their years as each subsequent birthday will be but the marking of a step nearer to the final fulfillment of all they have so long. Um, <laughs> so long hoped and labored for. Amen. Amen. <laughs> you laughing or crying? You're crying, you have donuts on your face. <laughs> Come here. Who is ready for some birthday cake? Me! <laughs> Does it look good? It looks amazing. I mean, you're gonna cook it, right? Yeah, do you wanna grab that pan? Yep. We're gonna do it here on camera. So, you wanna tell him what kind of birthday cake I requested? He wants chocolate cake with peanut butter frosting. Yum, yum, yum. So, we're doing a box mix cake, which I added a couple of extra goodies to, um, to make it a little, well, to try and see if it makes it any more special. And then homemade peanut butter frosting. And you guys may have never heard of peanut butter frosting. It's so good. I think this it's slightly like, regional. I th like a, Not, like Pennsylvania Dutch kind of. Yeah. Uh, so we grew up. On the border of Pennsylvania and Maryland. Yep. And I mean, I didn't. I didn't I really didn't, grow up with it. Me neither. But, but I think like in college, maybe high school or college we learned about it so i haven't made peanut butter frosting in absolutely just years so i'm gonna look up a recipe one of the recipes i saw had whipping cream in it so that you think of like really light and fluffy um it usually has powdered sugar peanut butter and apparently whipping cream and maybe some butter i don't know i don't know Hey, Peter. Yeah? It's snowing on your birthday. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Look at that. Making the peanut butter frosting. I am so excited. I'm only slightly feeling a little drought, or what do I say? Suffocated. Suffocated by the uh, recipe. When it, when it says, like, you have to have these exact... Like, it's like, put in your stand mixer with, with the, the paddle, paddle attachment. attachment. She's like, 
I do not want that specific of instructions. She feels su suffocated by recipes. But I hope that the sifting, my version of sifting, is going to make really good peanut butter frosting. Really excited. What's the difference between frosting and icing? Um, frosting and icing, I don't know. But guys, for my birthday, I got a new cast iron skillet. By new, we don't have any, we, we do have one enamel cast iron pan, um, but I have uh, been eyeing down cast iron for a while, and so I'm really excited for the first cook in it. I'm making some sweet potato fries, and we're gonna have sweet potato fries and cake. That's, that's birthday life. Okay guys, I was, I was wondering if that recipe was gonna work. Because <laughs> it was so chunky. It was so chunky. And, and dry. Then, and then Mary added the whipping cream. Can we taste it? Yes. All right. So it has whipping cream and makes it light and fluffy and kind of whipped creamy-ish. Oh yeah, that. Yeah, that's good. That's really good. All right. Can you see what it says? Let me see. <gasps> Peter! Oh wait. Oops. Happy HBD Peter. Yes, I did it. Thank you, honey. <laughs> that, mm. Mm, I tasted a little crumb with the icing. And it's so good. Really? Yeah, we aren't really hungry yet. No. So later on we'll have that. We went out and had a progressive lunch. Yes. So that's like when you go to one person's house and you eat the appetizer and then you go to the next person's house and you eat the meal. We did that in we high school. We didn't go to people's houses. We went <laughs> and got free, like different restaurants give you free things on your birthday. So we went and got a few things ending with a Starbucks nitro cold brew for her. Oh, it's so good. So anyway, all of that being said, we ate and we full. Yeah. So I guess we'll eat our sweet potato fries another time since we're not yes. hungry. And we'll eat this another time too, because we're not hungry. And I used that drawer as my cat counter space. Perfect. Oh, this is quite heavy. Got it. Wow, I legit almost dropped that. <laughs> okay, so fun. So basically what I did was I baked the cake in a nine by 13, and then I cut it in half and stacked it and put icing. But with a box mix, it's really hard to frost um because it like picks up the crumbs so i just kind of threw it on there and it'll be it'll taste fine because it's like icing on cake you know yeah. it doesn't really matter what it looks like but it says hbd peter yes oh don't stop now oh you scared him away with your water drops i was trying to capture it they were both drinking water at the same time it was so cute. All right, we did get hungry. So we're having arugula salad, tomato, some orange. Peter wanted some jalapeno on his, so he has jalapeno and a little bit of cilantro. I have a little bit of dill and our homemade dressing, which it was leaking the other day. And Peter's like, oh, you don't think it could be because it's got a paper lid. <laughs> it's, uh, but it wasn't because of the paper lid, I don't think. Now that, I, now that I say that, <laughs> no, it's all good. But the little pouring lid works great to pour our dressing. Birthday dinner. Yes. Plus, how were your um, sweet potato fries? Amazing. Woot woot. I can't believe I'm 32 years old and uh, it's something to celebrate. Something that Mary and I are like passionate about is not grieving getting older, but celebrating it because life is a reason to celebrate. And uh, I think that is a message that we hope comes across on these vlogs is that like every day, every year, a reason to celebrate. And this morning, Mary uh, read a prayer out of this little prayer book that I have and it was like a prayer for on your birthday. And one of the lines in there really stuck out to me. May this next year, I'm not exactly sure what it said, but it said something about um, f being free from regret. And I think that that is part of like celebrating getting older. It's not regretting 
uh, what lies behind us, but like pressing on toward what's ahead. And um, so anyways, thanks for celebrating with us today. It's been a fun day for Mary and I just to, we haven't done much, um, but we've had a sweet day of just being here at the house and uh, getting some good food and I'm excited to eat this cake and maybe we should go ahead and eat the cake. It's this book called Every Moment Holy and it's got prayers for like uh, different moments and like mundane moments in the day like a prayer for doing laundry and that sort of thing and just to remind you and uh, the crazy thing is when he told me about this book he was like it's things like a prayer for when you're doing laundry and I was like that sounds so cheesy but the way that this book like brings our minds to the purpose yes so like what are lessons you could like instill when you're doing laundry like how grateful you are to have clothing how yeah. how grateful you are that god provides for you and that, those sorts of things so it's not just like mm -hmm. I, I just think it's pretty, pretty yeah. cool um where's the part i think it was maybe on the last page um ne yeah never was yeah Basically, it's like in the middle of a sentence, but it says they will allow them to look ever with gladness and never with regret upon the passing of their years. Yeah. And I thought that was just what so well stated of how we want to face life, like ever with gladness and never with regret as the years go by. And um, yeah. And with that, we're going to we say... I thought we were gonna cut the cake. Oh, yeah, let's cut the cake. <laughs> the icing is so good, guys. This yeah. is not Peter's typical birthday cake choice, but this year he was feeling crazy. Well, I, okay, it's very um, like Reese's peanut butter cup fish. I just realized I'm not gonna be able to cut on this pan with this Here, knife. You want me to lift it and put it on the cutting board? Or I could use the back side of the knife. Sure. Okay. Look at that. Is it crumbling or? Well. It might be easier to use the actual knife. I just won't scrape it. Okay. Okay. And then I might grab a spatula, That's which smart. is our cheese shredder. Nice. <laughs> and where are we gonna put it? On this wood. Oh yeah, that'll be nice. Okay, ready? Wait for it, wait for it. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay. Mm. I mean, it's just like a pile of them. Um, Look at that. We we just ate a fancy restaurant and they're coming out with this peanut butter <laughs> chocolate cake. <laughs> oh man. They call it a rustic cake. A rustic cake. It's getting not quite perfect. Oh, look at that. <laughs> look oh, at all, all the icing. icing. Oh, you already have that. Oh. Okay. Ready? Oh. <laughs> maybe maybe the wood <laughs> late wasn't a great idea. Ready? Set go. Whoa. Mm. That's a lot of frosting. That's so good. <laughs> so good. I'm gonna need a glass of milk. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you guys. As Thanks. always. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night, Ollie.